Hey guys, this is Ray with Phone Arena and in this video we are going to take an in-depth look at the design of the new Samsung Galaxy Note Edge and its um, not so typical screen here. So uh, as far as appearance goes, uh, the Galaxy Note Edge has a traditional Samsung design language, at least when looked at the front here uh, with a trademark uh, physical phone key here surrounded by these barely visible uh, soft uh, keys for back and multitasking. So on top of it there is the speaker, uh, the proximity sensor and ambient light sensors as well as the front facing camera which is 3.7 megapixels uh, with a relatively low aperture of 1.9 so um, hopefully it will uh, provide good results uh, when doing when taking se selfies uh, one interesting thing about the home key here is that it has the a swipe fingerprint sensor it's not the ideal fingerprint sensor but still uh, it's better to have this one than to not have any plus it can do some pretty neat things like authorize PayPal payments unload the screen log you into your favorite websites and a bunch of other things so on the back side of the phone we have uh, this uh, 16 megapixel camera with fast autofocus and smart optical image stabiliz stabilization how smart it is we'll have to wait and see so um, the design language here is once again typical Samsung with this uh, fake leather texture finish here on the back uh, you know it's mostly uh, uh, it mostly depends on your taste if you're gonna like this or not but let's turn our attention to the start of the show here which is the 5.6 inch display with this curved screen area here so yeah this is one of those first uh, commercial products with a curved uh, display and in this case Samsung has tried to integrate the curved area of the screen into the experience of the phone in a pretty um, interesting way, in a variety of ways actually. For example, you can see how on the home screen, um, the curved screen area is reserved for your favorite applications. So uh, the, the main uh, area here of the home screen is uh, free from them and you can see more of your content like this. Uh, additional features here include this um, tools uh, field here you have a ruler for example a ruler if you need one a timer stopwatch let's take a look at this this is how it works the, you can activate the torch from here like this okay so this is the tools uh, line here and you can uh, of course access a variety of different things so what this includes is by swiping it this way you get access to your notifications and weather conditions you get the social network updates you get stocks info all of that is courtesy of Yahoo as you can see you even get news uh, flashlights here and some sports uh, results in the express me area which uh, shows which displays a custom piece of content here which is supposed to express your own uh, style to a certain extent so the screen itself as i said is 5.6 inches and it has quad hd resolution so it's an extremely high resolution uh, which makes things very fine very easy to read uh, it probably is a bit too much than uh, uh, necessary, but who knows, we'll have to wait and see. In terms of colors, uh, this uses the Samsung um, the Super AMOLED screen technology, which means that it can display extremely saturated and lush colors, but at the same time, like this. And, but at the same time, it can also stay more or less uh, realistic by sticking to the basic mode here you can see the preview right there so colors should be uh, more on the natural side when you are using the basic um, screen mode so that was our uh, look 
at the um, node edges uh, design characteristics and the screen. For more info, just check us out at phonearena.com.